my boy, the revolutionary. Fellow Americans, it is with the utmost pride and sincerity that I present this recording as a living testament and recollection of history in the making during our generation. The Brazilian finds show that the New World was discovered tens of thousands of years earlier than previously believed, and certainly well before the time of the American Indians. But who then were these pioneers? A much earlier wave of Mongoloids? Or another race altogether? Clues to the identity of the first Americans are emerging in rock shelters in the northeast and southeast of Brazil. Archaeologists have recently unearthed human remains. Prehistoric skulls were found buried in layers of soil, nine to twelve thousand years old. They are the oldest skulls in the Americas. And this is the oldest of them all. The skull of a young woman, nicknamed Luthia by scientists. Can she tell us who the first Americans were? Walter Nevis is a physical anthropologist at Sao Paulo University in Brazil. He has been using a standard and reliable archaeological measure, the shape of the skull, to find out what race she belonged to. He fully expected Luthia to be a Mongoloid, an ancestor of the American Indians. But then he fed the measurements into the computer. When we start running the computer and seeing the results, uh, it was amazing because we realized that uh, uh, the statistics, the quantitative analysis we were doing was not showing just people to be Mongoloid. In fact, the analysis was showing just people was anything except Mongoloids. Who then was Luthia? And where did she come from? To find out, the skull was taken to a hospital in Rio de Janeiro to begin the process of reconstructing her face. The first stage was to perform a three-dimensional CAT scan of Luthia's skull in order to build a replica. was then given to Richard Neve of the University of Manchester and one of the world's leading forensic artists to recreate her features. To me, is a Negroid face that has all the features that you associate with a Negroid face. The um, proportions of the face, it doesn't say anything about it being a Mongoloid. 